Hello. Nice see you again. Today is the second class. We are going to talk about how to get the chi, right? From dark energy and the dark matters. So we always ask you, what is dark energy? What is dark matters? Is a dark area? Is it dark? Yes, they are dark, which means you cannot see, right? Before we go down this concept, then we need because I think I need to give you guys a little bit of answer because there are so many people raised question. So I feel mm, I better clean up here. So here's a little bit because it is a big concept. Somehow I feel, you know, it's a lot of stress because it's a big concept. And the dump to you guys, I call the dump down, you know, because so big a concept is overwhelming at a purely small time to digest. So I really need to clean up this concept, all right? So the concept, which is last week we say, why women's health? What is the, the most important in women's health? Because one of the, the most important things for women's health is women can create a life. Then we say, how to define the life, right? So in the define the life, we say life, which is human beings. Life means is heaven's energy when the earth energy combining together, that's called a human. So in the other words, when you create a life, you create a nature's universal babies. Then, because of these things make a lot of people feel sad, a lot of people say, so I cannot get a print in my life, I didn't have children, that means I'm missing the opportunity, that means I didn't fit the requirement. It's not the whole truth. So I hope these things don't put a too much rational way say it. I just think it this way. When you get inherited the money, it depends on how you're going to use, right? And some people just donate it. And some people in the account, they even doesn't know how much money they have. And some people spend for house, cars, jewelries, right? It's your inherited. And it depends on how do you want to use. Think this way. Now your inherited gift can create a life. Only ways you have a choice. How do you want to use this gift? So how do you want? Some people say, no, my life, maybe I didn't have chance. I try, I cannot. Then you see, what do they do? They apply this, apply this gift to the other areas. Maybe music, maybe arts, maybe project, maybe other things, right? The most important things you have to see because what you get this gift, it's for free, right? It's unconditional love from the universe. It's not like a, you get a donation and for the humans from some organization, then they put the, you know, restrict it. You only can use A, B, C, otherwise you cannot use this. No, right? Entire creativity is up to you. So we say life is based on the chi, right? It's energy. So therefore, can, you can use this as the energy healing, right? So you have to really think through, it's not just to see this part, okay, oh yes, I bet I don't have children, but you might have a cat, you might have a dog, you might have other things, right? They are your babies too, right? Just how do we define it? So therefore, it has to be open up much bigger concept. Right, don't stuck in the small things. Yes, maybe someone goes through that in the life it has many different reasons. All right, called reason. They are no accidents, right? So 
you can also look that there are no accidents as the challenge. Maybe you are so special in this life, you are willing to take the other path to challenge. Think of that. What kind of challenge? Instead, of become as the mother. So can you become and the creativity can create the life, right? Can create the things. So now, how do you do these things? How can you create this? So you just, that's it. I try to give the answer. Don't really look at the just one thing. Okay, I don't have children, right? Look at the, the other angle. Look at the positive way. So that's why we challenge it. I challenge everyone, right? It's not just a normal class or you just listen. It's the project. Women's health is a project. You have to understand this, right? Last time we say that our this project, our this course is much bigger just use Qigong for women's health. Right? Most likely we say, okay, women's health, they gotta be deal with the disease. How do I use, you know, the Qigong heal the headache, heal the, you know, shoulder pain, heal the, you know, allergy, cure the, the wrinkles. That's, you know, that's my opinion is a waste opportunity. They are much bigger and much bigger. And the most exciting things in our, this program is, we are not from disease area angles, right? We often think because I have illness and the disease, then therefore I don't have health. So women's health must focus on how to deal the cure the disease. Otherwise, I don't have health, right? That's not the whole truth, right? Because health of the balance and the disease and illness exist. Right? That's different ways. It's a cause and effect. Right? So we must change it different ways. So therefore, we try to see things different. I try to guide you guys. You must see what is the unique, unique energetic concept. Right? So we say Qigong for why Qigong is energy healing. So once we apply for energy healing, then we must follow energy healing laws, right? So I say to you guys, you wanna go down this way? As long as you say, I'm energy healer, I'm energy healing, hey, energy always related or related to consciousness. As long as energy, that's consciousness. That's consciousness, that's a purpose, see? That's a purpose. What is the purpose? So that's why last time, last class, we are focused on one of the, the most important, the most unique things, create the life, right? The creativity in it. So I ask you the homework. I don't know how many people really did this homework. If you use this homework, right? Understand the homework related to the creativity of the life. First, what is it? love? Without the love, there's no life. If you understand this concept, just understand, just do the homework in that area. There are many different issues. And such like you have issues with your parents will be dissolved. You can save many years the therapist time. I'm sorry, therapist. You know, it's not that I try to take the business away from you guys. I'm just tell you, they make you realize that's something and the tremendous different angles. That's not just a theory. I've been used this way in my practice. I can give you one of the exciting, you know, the real case, right? So I have one patient, you know, he's a very nice guy, he's very successful in the business and a great family, wife, children, but he just have issues with his mother, right? How many years in the therapy? Are they good, are they bad, are they always? You know, one day he always come in and so always say that this. I say, your mother loves you. Yes, I know, but I can't handle some. I can't handle that. There's always something that he feel the mother doesn't love enough about him. I say, all right, you willing to do anything? He said, yes, anything you ask, I'm willing to do. 
I said, I give you one homework, you should do that. And then if it still doesn't help you, then I will shut up. I won't say anything, right? He said, what you want me to do? I said, go get a baseball and put it in the back and carry that baseball in the front of you for a week. So do you know what that means? That means day and the night, eat, sleep, take a shower. You have to carry this front of you for a week and the next week I see you when the next week he come I say how do you feel he said what did you done to me I said I just give you experience I said how long you can hold he even he even cannot hold the one day he said see one day your mother have to hold you for how many months just after that experience he dissolved the many years the issue with his mothers. Think of this, how simple it is. You need the experience for the love, for the someone willing to love you and carry you from out. Right? So in the so many issues in the last week we talk about the creativity. Can you create right in the life? You can create that many things that can change. So this week, we say that because, because. In this life, there are no accidents, right? Your spirit make a decision. Say, in this life, I willing to experience in a woman's body. You make a decision, right? You make the decision. Once your spirit make the decision, what do you do? You gathering the information. You gathering the material from your parents, right? But the most important things you download. Think of the software. You download the software from the universe, allow you can processing because you are the woman's body. You are capable and able to create universal lives, universal babies. So therefore, the universe will give you a VIP path. Think of this, VIP path for what? It's a special code. What is a special code means? That special code will allow you enter dark energy and the dark matters. What is? Is the source of the life. It's the source of the life. It's infinity. Right? As of today, as of today, you know, the modern science, we discovered what do we know of the entire universe. We only know 4%, the other 96% the stuff at the there, we don't know. So that's why what they call, the science call all of these things called the dark energy and the dark matters. But they are the resource, they are the root of the life. So therefore, the woman belong to this category. So women's body carry this special access code, allow you enter in a much easier, put it this way, they are much easier than the men to enter this resource because they need to go from there to download the information for the babies, which is that baby's universal baby and the down the road, 10, 20, 30, 50 years later, they have a purpose, just like each one of the you today, your parents, your mother did exactly the same thing and download the information to you. So therefore, you be able to sit here, we be able to sit here and fight for the COVID-19. The, all the information is there. The wisdom is. So we need to think in this way, it's called a category. That is the one of the beautiful things, right? So therefore that it is what? It's called invisible, right? There's always a visible and invisible. It's a complementarity, visible, invisible. If you want a fancy way in the Chinese, they call yin and yang. Right? So you heard the people in yang theories. You heard the people say, wow, I do tai chi, I do yin yang. Right? You go to the modern science, they say complementarity, positive and negative. Every particle has antiparticles. So what does that mean? Every one of the you has the other of the soul of you. Where are they? 
deep space, right? That's your deep space because entire whole universe are only one of you. So therefore, you will be the life particles as a human, as a particles, right? Think this way. So therefore, is one of the other particle, the other concept is very important to connect to the woman's health. Visible, invisible. Every visible behind is invisible. Think of this way. So whatever what we see, we only see visible. But the behind the visible is invisible. But the invisible always much bigger than the visible. So people will ask you, no, you guys already think of what's that going to do for women's health? That do everything about the women's health. It's not just the women's health, that do anything about everything. Everything. Men's health is exactly the same thing because now you'll be able to say, okay, now it's not my headache, right? So behind the headache, what is? Right? It's not a situation right now. I have a difficulty at the school. So what is it behind the events? That's in the other events, right? Invisible, always bigger than the visible. Right? Think of this entire whole concept. So what is this concept? That means a category. You belong to which category? So the women belong to this invisible category. Men belong to the visible category. Because in this invisible category, that means you have a special path connected to all of this invisible stuff, invisible frequency. You have a path. Much easier. Men also can get in because they are created by invisible. So therefore, somehow, but they need to digest. They need to transform the, this wisdom to become the other way. So it's not easy. It's not directly. But for women's body, it's directly. It's inside the software. Anytime, anywhere you want to function will be there. So therefore, this concept will allow us to apply for the disease, illness. If you think you have disease, illness, or you think you want to accomplish next level of your life. Next level of your health is the same concept. What do you focus? If you focus on some visible, that's always invisible, right? So you need a real thinking this way, visible and invisible. So invisible is much bigger than the visible. So the visible and the invisible, they always connect. But unfortunately, we only see the visible. Right? So that is very, very, very important concept. So because of this code, that in this visible, invisible concept behind this what? It's called a cooperation. It's called a harmony, which is also in the life, it's based on the harmony and the cooperation, right? Visible and invisible. Egg and sperm, positive, negative has to be meet requirement, visible, invisible, male, female, at the right time, right place, you, if you meet the requirement, that's the child, that's the new life. Now think this whole concept. So therefore, no matter how old you are, if you meet the requirement, you still be able to produce life, right? Right? You often heard the people say, Oh, yeah, I don't care. I come back in next life. If you believe the life of recurrence, which is called the, the, you know, recognitions, if you believe this, right? Sometimes it doesn't have to believe this. It's just a front of you. If you have a kids, just look at your kids. That's part of you. You don't need to wait until next life. In this life, they are front of you now. Right? I often tell them, my patients, you don't have to wait. Your kids is your next life just a different versions look at that right so you have to see okay if that meet the requirement something can happen now the question is become the in and the young positive and negative visible invisible can you reverse the, to yourself without the outside think this way can you can you do that but you wait outside and then go forward 
but with yourself, can you go backward? Then you'll be forever young, right? But not many people discovered. So anyone discovered, never tell, right? So therefore, we are constantly looking for special herbs, special, you know, remedies or something can do. But unfortunately, it's not that way. We have to use this concept, use these theories, apply in our life and it continues, right? So therefore, this is one of the second very important concept in a woman's health. So therefore, when we deal health, the health become events, right? The health become product. So behind the health is what? It's a health consciousness. It's a health think, feeling, right? So then you better ask yourself, how do you feel your health? How do you think about your health? Then what is your own consciousness behind what you think? The materialized health. So this way, you change the focus. Instead of focus on the disease and illness, you focus on the creativity, how to create health. Right? Same way. It's the same energy. Right? Because it's qi. Right? We say that many times, why qigong? Because qigong is so unique. They can help you discover from the body, mind, spirit level. Will allow you truly understand, allow you experience everything to connect. Allow you experience this dark energy and the dark matters. Is there? It's a possible. It's a possible through your body. You need the body to experience. So Qigong is the one of the unique way to experience. So that's why we say use Qi. Right? Connect the Qi from dark energy and the dark matters. That will be this class. So in this week, I would like each one of you go home, do the homework. Homework, that's always need the homework. You need to challenge yourself. Don't waste your time. Homework. Homeworks apply. Apply this concept, visible, invisible. So look at your body, look at your life from the every visible point of view. What did you see? And then what do you see behind the visible? Suppose you have a headache. Who is your headache? What is your headache? You have a shoulder pain. What is the shoulder pain, right? What caused the shoulder pain? You didn't carry 100 pounds, right? Even now, most people at the home, you don't do this. Then why you have lower back pain? Why you do this? There's every event behind it. There's always invisible things. So this week is a challenge for everyone. Not to focus, not to just to focus on the visible level. Try go beyond visible level. List all the issues, all the some areas you want to accomplish, you want to break through. Try at least try use this concept. Can you see behind this visible events or situations or conditions? That will be your homework. Before we finish, I just have to one more thing. I know a lot of people will have questions. You can put the questions on. I will answer immediately. But next, start next week, I will slowly start the question and answer. Right? Answer the some questions. I still recommend that each one of you don't try jump out the question. Let the question leave it there, flow on the air. Let you processing. Let you experience. All right, let you practice Qi. Does anyone practice three e Qigong now? You need the feeling. You need to feel your body. You need to change your belief. You need to do the homework. So it's the journey, right? It's the healing journey. Healing journey relied on the Qi, relied on the energy, right? So you have to believe yourself. Right? So as a someone there, if you are not a woman, that's the best place, right? So therefore you don't need to watch a movie, what's the woman wanna? Now you know the every secrets, 
right? The man might get more benefit, right? Then the woman, woman need to thinking differently. You are unique. You really need to thinking that's a unique way. They are no accidents. The law of the energy healing. They are no accidents. So when we end this class, I would like each one of you stand up. If you can't stand up, I'm gonna sit here because otherwise I stand up and no one can see me, right? So you guys, would you please stand up? Hold the last posture, right? You are dragon standing between and heaven, right? You are spirit, right? Each one of you stay, the, stay there between heaven and earth. Make your thumb point each other. Close your eyes. Real listen. Close eyes. Relax. Okay, so do the homework, please do the homework, right? So you have a question, so think about that thing. You still have a question, either you hold it, you can put it on. I will take a look and then I will find the correct or the answer. Some questions together and then give you, try to give you your answer. Okay, so do your homework, please. It's very important. It's your healing journey. The answer lies within. See you guys next week.